Luminosity masking is actually a lot easier to use than you might think. Let me show you how to use it and exactly how luminosity masks work. Luminosity mask creates a selection of the image. Anything that's white is being selected. Anything that's black is not. It creates that selection based on the lightness values of your image. You make a luminosity mask. You have a lights luminosity masks here on the right. You have darks luminosity masks and you have midtones one through six. Now, the lower the number, the less selective it is. As you increase the number, it continues to become more selective. If you can see a light six barely selects the brightest spots in the image. Darks would be the exact opposite. And then midtones will select the midtones. Now you can pair these with just about any layer in Photoshop, but some of the most popular options are the curves or levels adjustments, brightness contrast, or the hue saturation. But don't feel limited to just these options. Let me show you how I like to use it in this image. We'll grab a lights two selection. We're going to grab the curve and we are just going to darken that. So you can see how that brings a little bit more details into the scene. We can go right back in there. We'll grab something like a darks four. We'll grab the curve again, and we will just brighten those darks. Then let's go ahead and do one more. We're gonna just do mid-tone contrast by grabbing a mid-tones two mask. We will create another curve. We'll create a simple little S curve there and create some mid-tone contrast. So that is just one of the many ways you can use luminosity masks to improve your images.